Good day and welcome back to another Vampire Survivors video. In this one we're going to be doing Mortachio. Uh, and yeah, uh, at this point, we're kind of good. Um, like in terms of, you know, I guess, stuff. So realistically we just need to get uh, level 80 on this guy. And then kind of take things from there. So uh, I'm going to be doing a hyper hurry run just to win the library uh, with Mortasio because we need to hit level 80. Um, and then from there, we're basically going to just uh, sort of like, yeah, how can I say, uh, basically double up um, and start really just kind of like getting some rerolls and stuff like that because we do need uh to i, I want to take on like the end content um for sure but i do just also like want to uh really just kind of i want to say clear every base challenge but yeah i just i just kind of want to you know get that sort of experience with with the game and and kind of have every like main hero done. Um, I know it's you know I say hero or character or whatever you want to call them, but yeah, essentially I just want to kind of get like a really good, a really good run going with these guys and just kind of enjoy myself and, and have a really good time. So yeah, I think that'll be good um, for me, uh, you know, overall and, and just be a really fun way to like finish off the game but yeah this will be uh we're gonna basically just hit level 80 here that's kind of the main goal getting a clear would also be great but hitting level 80 would be good because i want to try and get a reroll uh to try and uh take on the capella magnus stage you know with uh, various ease and everything so i think that's definitely uh, my main goal uh but yeah, it's it's just going to be something that I think we need to uh, try and try and work on uh, is getting to level eighty, you know, clearing up all these fights and everything. So, but yeah, um, Mostachio, Motachio, um, you know, what whatever is however you want to say his name uh, is obviously a very cool character. I believe his weapon didn't have an evolution, although maybe now it does. I don't know. When I first played the game, it did not have an evolution. Uh, so, it was one of those things. I did not need to take the cooldown term here, but uh, you know what, it's fine, it's whatever. Um, so yeah, uh, didn't have didn't have an evolution. I, I don't know if it does now. Uh, but yeah, for me, definitely... Um, one of the cooler characters, his bones can be pretty, pretty dope, um, and he himself can be pretty dope as well, um, once he gets everything going. Gone for a bit of an interesting build here, trying to maximize our, trying to really maximize our growth potential. So lots of crown, lots of, uh, like all the buffs we've taken have been, uh, you know, a lot of them are EXP based, um, so I'm really hoping we can kind of hit a really good curve uh, when it comes to like, you know, um, really pentagram for last, definitely. Uh, hoping we can hit a good curve when it comes to like growing and getting XP and just kind of really doing our thing uh, nicely because. Yeah, if we can do that, then we'll grow super fast. Uh, we're already level 18, uh, which is good. And then you know, we can sort of push onwards. Um, just need to be careful about the phases where we do have curse because it can be uh, a bit dangerous for us if we are a bit low. Uh, but once those pass, then we have these big moments of um, you know, basically huge moments of EXP gain and everything and that's really good of course so yeah um, honestly pretty straightforward like build 
uh, I say straightforward, but you know, nothing too crazy. I want to say, like, should be pretty much in control the whole time um, with all these upgrades. And the bones are really like in this stage, the bones are really good because the enemies come from both sides, and the bones will all bounce. Um, and Mustache himself, he gains a lot of projectiles as well, by the way. So. Like that's also why I'm trying to focus mainly on projectile based like abilities because they they do also help out um, with his you know, sort of abilities and everything. So um, yeah, Mustachio, a pretty cool cat. Um, goal is to get him to level 80 and then uh, from there we'll probably push on. I might do another level 80 run. Uh, just to have some rerolls, because rerolls can really just help you get your build uh, sorted early on, which I think is something that's really helpful actually, uh, because a lot of the times, like especially early game, not getting the items you want, or you can hit like that, uh, you can get successive items you want, and then kind of hit like a mid slack, like a little bit of like, oh, okay, I'm not. Yeah, you know, I went from getting everything I want, now I'm not getting anything I need, and like it's just disrupting my build, and I'm not going to be able to control it or handle it, so it's definitely something uh, that I would say you you want to consider, um, you want to consider focusing on and building around and everything like that. Mm. Uh, I've actually screwed up here because we can't take, but uh, you know what? Pentagram, it's fine. Got to start working on it at some point. Uh, oh, that's bad. That's bad timing. But it's fine. I'd rather get the early levels out the way. I find if you take Pentagram, if you can get like the early three or four levels out the way, it doesn't impact you as negatively uh, as it otherwise might when it's when it you know when it isn't. Uh, taken early on, but yeah. Oh, yeah. See, this is the this is what I was talking about. The surge here. We need to be very careful because we don't have revives, so it's it's a very uh, there's a bit of a dicier time for us. But if you can get through them, then you get you know you come out with these very big uh, EXP spikes, which is awesome. So yeah, a bit of a catch twenty two kind of situation um, in a good way. I also think we might level up our wand, our whip, sorry, a bit earlier on, um, because that will help us out a lot. Being able to heal uh, is very good, of course, as always. But uh, no, I think we're having a very successful run here. Um, very, very, very successful. Very easy probably all gonna run yeah had to take the risk they're all running probably super smooth there we go get that upgrade booyah so now we have the now we have the sword but we got all these projectiles going um now we're gonna get get this area roaming um don't really know what the area was for actually probably one of my worst calls I uh, should have got the duration for, obviously, uh, our, our books, but it's fine. Cooldown works well enough with the books, so they end up being somewhat effective anyway, um, which is fine. But yeah, level 40, uh, going swell. Fire wand upgrade, very good. So far, so good. Now we should easily crack the level 80 mark. Um, it's just going to depend on ourselves basically and let's go um hmm. gemini not really useful uh this could be useful definitely um let's see if we only have that not really helpful iron will gains up to three bounces um i guess but we don't even have any of those so this is only one slash. It's fine, but it is one of those things. It is what it is. Wow, fifty-one percent extra EXP. That's actually insane. That's actually really nuts. 
Okay, we go whip, 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 whip it real good, dun, 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 dun. Whip it real good, dun, 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 dun. Easy, easy. Uh, gimme, 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 gimme. Ooh, nice. Good luck with the. Lots of really good luck there with the. Uh, with the eclipse. Actually, really nice. Um, that's awesome. Trying to avoid taking eclipse, like I said, until we really get. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay. Look at that. Look at the Bibles. Even without the upgrade, basically up all the time because of the cooldown reduction. Whip. Okay, cool. That should be whipped down. Oh, one more level. Okay, that's fine. Nice. Uh, yeah. Yeah, right, that's okay. Books is always fine. Whip would have been good. There we go, whip. Okay. So now we can start to kind of focus on uh, Eclipse as like an ability. Let's just get a bit more XP gain. Easy peasy. Um, yeah, I don't know. If we hit level 80 super early, I might just end the run. Uh, because there's no real reason for us to be in here beyond that really oh there we go bloody tear okay now we're good now we are good now we are cooking um we are cooking hard even with the curse surge and that this one this uh randasmo is actually really nice we like because the curse surge is followed by the exp surge so you, you kind of like always just end up um you always just end up like cooking like you always just end up with a really really good um ability like it's crazy actually yeah we're gonna take start to take some eclipses yeah level 57 no, easy the build's working the build's working it's working it's really working as Anakin would say no but but it is, it is, it's working very effectively. Um, we're healing nicely. Okay, taking a little bit of chip damage, it's okay. Uh, I'm not going to take that, I'm going to take this. Yeah, I don't want to lose, I don't want to you know, lose the chest accidentally. Yeah, easy, give me that gold. Booyah, kasha. Booyah, kasha. I don't even know what booyah, kasha means. Was it from Rocket Power? I used to watch Rocket Power as a show. It was like badass. And then when they went to the future and they were all like legendary skaters or something. That was pretty dope. I won't even lie. Rocket Power was my jam. Yeah, we're good. I think this is it. Um, I don't really see anything else like. Yeah, this will be Moon Glow. Okay, excellent. So now we can't lose items. Easy peasy. Run over. Um, hit level 80 and call it, I guess. Like, is there any reason to stay? I'll stay for the win, yeah. I'll stay for the gold. Stay for the win. Stay for the vibes. Yeah, easy. An easy game. An easy run. I can't tell if we're low on health, like, because we're gaining health, or what the situation is. Uh, what is our growth rate? Wow. Curse is up to 35% though, which is pretty nuts, like, if you think about it. But I think that's during, no, that's, that's without the, the curse phase. Easy. Uh, should we just take gold? Like, is there any reason not to? Yeah, we we'll just take gold. Let's just earn some gold. Let's earn some gold. Let's earn some gold. Uh, this should be fire wand. Oh, multiple chest. Oh, we're gonna make some big bank here as well. Easy peasy. 
because I need these for upgrades as well, so this helps. I'm gonna do the defang upgrades. Wow, 1,729 in a chest. Crazy. Um, I might do Gatia Mari next, actually. I know they're not te like they're not technically. Yeah, they're not technically for a reroll or anything, but like I'm kind of just feeling, kind of just feeling the vibe. Uh, lots of gold that they can drop as well, so just in general cool stuff um, that you can get. So I'm kind of down for that. Uh, at least overall, I'm down for that. I think it could be something really rad. But yeah. Um, Honestly, this run is pretty much done. Um, I don't know if you guys want to stay and watch this whole thing, but like it, it is literally done. It is like we didn't even have to touch the screen. Okay, this will be interesting. The skeleton, uh, see, easy. It's not, it's, it's not hard, man. Look at that. We're racking in the gold, though. You know what? I'll stay because I want to see how much gold we can get, like as a run. In general, I want to see what the. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Now, <laughs> look at that. Wow. We are getting gold like you can't believe. This is going to be like a 20k run, I think, give or take. Which is good. I think that's my highest run uh, that I've ever got. Um, which is crazy. Um, absolutely mental, actually. Yeah, look at that. Okay, easy. What should we take with the Randasmo? Anything gold related? Gain re three revives. Healing is doubled. Listen weapons almost emit special damage zones. Uh, healing doubled. Revives. Eh, yeah. Yeah, and then we can just really uh, soak in the exquisite gameplay of standing still and not being bothered. Easy levels as well. What's our growth at? Wow, 102%. That's incredible. That's amazing. Um, I can't believe that actually. Where we at money wise? Like 12 and a half K? Nah, it, it is a wrap. I mean, it's been a wrap for a while, but it's it's a it's a wrap wrap. Like it's a head on wrap. Uh, up to now, 12, 5, 8, 1. Huge. Um, yeah, I think we're hitting critical mass, like with all the upgrades, uh, like all the upgrades, all the characters, the randasmos as well, like the randasmos add so much uh, to your gameplay, like unlocking it is such a big bell curve for you, just signaling like a complete change in your gameplay, meta, performance, whatever man, like however you want to say it, it just completely changes how you how you do um, which is crazy and look at that like another 2k gold up to 15k wow that's a lot um, I think you could make more like I kind of want to do a Gadiamari run and just see how much money I can make like in one run see how much money I can make like okay if I really really pushed it how much money could I make in one room? Yeah, that would be that would be something I think could be super interesting. Um, I think it could be something that will happen. Why not? Like, why not try it out? Here comes the big witch. Uh, ooh, the curse. Okay, so there, that curse. Like, that curse means something you can see. Like, we are taking damage. Um, okay, she's now defeated though. We can claim the chest. Big money again, up to 17 grand. Yeah, with her out the way now, pretty much done. Um, yeah, nice, nice run. Uh, again, not a full evolution run though. Well, one item, I think. I mean, I don't know, someone's gonna have to correct me. Uh, one item, I think, can't evolve, so I'll kind of put that down there, but I think, yeah, overall, uh, pretty good. Anything was the books. I should have taken duration and then picked up the cooldown. Um, but yeah, at the end of the day, we didn't need it. So, what can I say? You know, what can I say? Um, except, you're welcome. 
<laughs> get it. Okay. Don't worry about it. You'll get it when you have kids. 20, no, 19,000. Okay, we can hit 20k here. That's going to be really good. So more to show. Done. Level 80 as well. Done. Uh, everything done. Everything good. Everything easy. I think, yeah. Um... I don't really know, yeah, once, probably I will take on Capella Magna uh, next, just because, like, I want to unlock that and then kind of do the whole limit breaking thing, and then I think that's definitely the point where it's like, okay, that has been the peak core, um, the core, uh, Vampire Survivors experience, so... Yeah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna like deny myself uh, trying out something else, but it, it's worked out really, really well. Uh, it's actually been a really, really good. I, th I think we failed one or two runs along the way, but now we're just clean, racking up victories left, right, and center, achievements left, right, and center. Really, just kind of smoking it. I mean, 22k in one run. That's huge. 23k now. 23k, level 145. You don't really get um, situations like this where we're just scoring out so big. Um, well, you don't get situations like this in the beginning of the game, but yeah, good stuff. Um, here comes the Reaper. Excellent. Uh, you know, we could try a revive. Uh, but no, if we had Laurel, maybe I would. Reach level 80, there we go, we got another reroll. And we can buy some power ups. Like the final level of Defang and of Might. And buy Revive. And buy Speed. Buy a reroll, actually. Yeah, we'll buy a reroll. So, yeah, we, I mean, we're good. We're looking good. Maybe it's time to take on Capella Magna. But that's it from me. See you next time. Bye.